I'm here at Lake of the Prairies. That's the Shellmouth Dam behind me. And we're gonna be fishing the rock wall, trying to catch us a trophy class rock bass. The, uh, the rock bass, they live right up in the rocks here. It's pretty uncommon to find them in open water. It's not impossible. I'll never say never, but your best bet is to catch them kind of in the riprap here. So that's what we're gonna be doing. So we'll see what we can do. Whew, just about went down there. Um, so yeah, I just have my Fenwick Fluger Nighthawk here and my net, and then I got my trusty tackle bag behind me. And basically I have tied on a slip bobber rig and a tungsten frostbite little jig. And we're gonna be tipping that with a night crawler and seeing what we can do. So we got some night crawlers. And our little little frostbite tungsten jig here, slip bobber. See, all we need is a little piece of a night crawler. And we're gonna be mobile here. We're gonna just walk the dam all day and uh, kind of work our way down. That's the plan. Anyways, we're gonna keep on moving. Basically take five, 10 steps and then uh, Try again another cast. So. There we go, we're hooked up with something. Hopefully, it's a rocky. Doesn't feel huge, but uh, we'll get the net anyways. Might be a pike looking at it. Nope, it's a walleye. Oh, and I, and I lost them. Well, shucks. Well, that was cool. Not what I'm looking for, but uh, we'll take it. Yeah, so we hooked what looked like possibly, I don't know, an 18 inch walleye. It would have been too big to keep probably. Um, but yeah, we're looking for a rock bass here. That's what we're doing. This is a trophy walleye fishery and I'm out here targeting rock bass so yeah on that strike I basically just watched my bobber go down and just kind of swept into that fish not really a big hook set maybe should have done a little bit bigger but oh well not the end of the world Okay, we're hooked up again. Feels kind of pikey. Oh, it's another walleye, unfortunately. Oh, and we lost him as well. Shucks darn. Two walleye that we haven't landed now. Still looking for rock bass. So we'll see what we can do. Okay, try that again. Come on, be a rock bass. Mr. 
the walleye. Yeah. One fucking fish. Alright, try not to fall in. There he goes. Alright, so we didn't catch any rock bass, which is kind of a failure. We did hook into three walleye. We lost two of them ashore and then uh, we did land the third one. Um, but yeah, like I did say, um, yeah, the wind noise is probably terrible. Didn't catch a single rock bass, so that's a failure in my book, but just means that I have to come back and try again. Uh, my wife, she's at the campsite with her little guy, so that's where I'm on my way back to now. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's been a good trip. Ended up doing some shore fishing. It's been a good trip. Uh, I think next time we're gonna bring the boat. I think it's always easier to pull a fish out away from shore rather than into it. Oh look, and there's some bear poop here on the dam. So for all of you guys, be aware. Looks like it's full of grain and berries though, so. I mean, it's kind of that season, but gotta be bear smart, so don't need them in the campground ruining someone's trip. So anyways, yeah, this was the maiden voyage for my wife and I, pulling our new fifth wheel camper. So, I mean, we did have the option to pull the boat and I opted to not. I mean, we went up to a wedding before this, so that would have kind of been in the way. And then uh, from there, we came up here with our little four month old boy. And yeah, I mean, again, just felt like it was gonna be too much to manage. So funny story, we actually ran into some people that we knew from back home in Balder. And yeah, they invited us out. So we had some good days with them. And I mean, we had plenty of fish to eat. So it's been a good trip. I'm just working my way down the, the rock dam right now. and. Gonna, whew, I don't like those bumblebees. I wonder if I should just jump up on the road here. No, I'm gonna do that. All right, thanks for tuning in, guys. And uh, hopefully have some more content coming for you guys. I know it's been pretty dry lately.